Meisner Gallery was founded uh, back in the early 60s. My father was an apprentice for Jacques Lipschitz, a sculptor. There's no other facility in the world where you can get bronze casting and acrylic casting done in the same building. Nobody else does it. Uh, we're one of only three facilities in the world that we know of that does acrylic casting of sculpture. So I'm second generation. Uh, my mom and dad ran the business for, for many, many years. They had been doing bronze the whole time. When I came into the business 30-something years ago, I started looking at new materials that we could work with, and one of those is acrylic, and that's where I've spent most of my time. I stumbled in here years ago, just uh, not knowing a thing and hoping for the best, and Mitch was kind enough and willing to help me out and has led me to, to here. There are so many materials today available to the artists that were not available even five years ago. Currently, I am working on a couple of different things. Um, the biggest and the most important really would be the General MacArthur statue. That is going to be a life-size monument in MacArthur Airport here on Long Island. In making the MacArthur piece, there's a lot that went into that. In the very beginning, before even touching a piece of clay, we had to do a lot of research. And once you had that information, you need to move on to the actual piece, but you can't just put clay together. Clay by itself will not stand up, so you need an armature. And you build the armature, which is just the skeleton, if you will. And from there, once you have that in the pose you'd like, you add the clay. Once the clay has been added, then you need to make a mold. And from your mold, you make your casting. From there, you pour in the material, whatever that may be, and you've got now your piece, a positive image coming from the negative of the mold. And from there, there's a lot of chasing that goes into it. When I say chasing, I mean cleaning up of seams, touching things up, and doing a patina, which would be your finished color on the piece. Meisner Gallery is really a multifaceted business. We help artists to create their work, get it from their model to whatever material they want, whether it be bronze or acrylic or fiberglass. We also help them to get their work into galleries around the world. It gives them exposure that they might not otherwise get. And being that we've been in the business, I've been in the business myself already over 30 years, it's easy for us to help, or easier for us, to help a young artist get that start that they need. And working here day to day, taking other people's sculptures into the foundry, making the molds off of them, making the castings in all the different mediums. I definitely learned a lot about the techniques involved, but in addition to that, I'm able to take a lot of information away from how they're making their pieces of art. What makes us different is the fact that we're still here. Most foundries are gone, it's a dying art, and we're just, I'm just immersed in it. I grew up with the art, I love, the, I love sculpture, it's a passion, and I probably should have gotten out of the business many years ago, but I'm sticking with it.